Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the JFK Coliseum for tonight's Division One matchup between the Memorial Crusaders and the Central West Little Blue Knights. Tonight's starting lineup for the Memorial Crusaders in goal number 30, Matt Scott. On defense, number 19, Brandon Murphy. His partner, number 11, James Austin. At forward, number 10, Brandon Burroughs. And at forward, number 20, Kenneth McIntyre. And on forward, number 5, Ricky Bohair. For the home central, in goal number 31, Jordan Lamar. <laughs> on defense number 24, Noah Orr. <laughs> on defense number 10, Matt Blair. <laughs> At right wing, number 9, Matt LaFour. <laughs> At left wing, number 3, Finn McDonough. Aiden Kelly. Fans, if you'd please rise and remove your hats for the playing right now. John Fitzgerald Kennedy Coliseum here in Manchester, New Hampshire for the Division I matchup between the Memorial Crusaders and the Central West. I guess it'll be the Little Knights or something. Uh, I'm Kyle Heavey from Manchester Public Television. Thank you very much for taking the time and watching this wonderful game. One of these two teams tonight will be getting their first win. It's been a tough season so far for the Memorial Crusaders and the Central West Little Green, or Little, Cruc Little Knights, I don't know, we'll call them that. The uh, Memorial comes in with a 0, 10, and 1 record, while the Central West team has a 0 and 10. So one of these two teams tonight will get their first win. We'll be covering it all day long here, and I hope you enjoy this coverage here for the Manchester Public Television. These two teams, they Central, they come out of their huddle there, as Memorial has already come out of their huddle. Starters for Memorial include Ricky Bo Parlant, he's a captain. Brandon Burrows, forward. James Austin, assistant captain, he's a defenseman. Br Brandon Murphy, defenseman. Kenneth McIntyre and Matthew Scott in goal. For Central West, you got Finn McDonough, Aiden Kelly, Matt LaForge, Matt Blair, Noah Orr, and in goalie, we got Jordan Lamar. Officials getting the pucks out of the lovely snowy buckets that they have to keep the pucks in. Looks like we, uh, we're ready to go. Let's get this on. Goalies say yes, they're ready. Officials drop the puck and it is won by Memorial. 
flick up. Central, bring, oh, Memorial blocks it. Central trying to get something going on here. They're trying to get it out of the zone, but nice job by Boparlin for Memorial to try to get it, ar get it around. Coming around, flick up. They're trying to get, oh, it looks like Memorial has something going on. Oh, just barely missed. Nice pass by Ricky, but just barely missed by Matt Blair. Excuse me, by Brandon Burrows. Come around. Memorial takes the puck away from Central West, trying to get it around. Stopped by James Austin there. Over to McIntyre. McIntyre tries to get it up to Ricky. Ricky, nice back pass. Looks like we get a line change from Memorial there. He's flicked the puck in there. And the goalie decides to just cover it up. A good job by Justin Russell to kind of cause a little stress and frustration there for the goalie. He decides he doesn't want to let this puck go back through him with only 59 seconds into this game. Central West coached by Eric Fisher, while Memorial is coached by Mark Putney. Oh, a slap shot. Come, nice wrister. Come around, and we have a goal! Well done there, the Memorial. He cleaned up, got the rebound, looked and put it right through. Memorial will take the one nothing lead. Brandon Burrows with that goal. Faceoffs are crucial there. That was right there. Memorial won that. Nice snap from the blue line. Gets the rebound, and we got a goal. Memorial wins this faceoff here. My man Parker Burgess takes it. Skating around. Throws it up. I thought he was someone who was going to be there, but it was not. Chase Fidella comes back. Looks for something. Parker gets it. Nice moves. He's got a three on two break, possibly. Parker comes up, misses, gets the, misses the, the check attempt. Gets it around. Oh, no goal. Officials say something happened there. Oh, the goal came out of the moorings. That's a, that's a tough one right there. Memorial really had something there. That line, Matthew Gazetta, Parker Burgess, they're, they're looking good. So we'll see what happens here. But now we got the top line. Kenneth McIntyre wins the faceoff, throws it back. Nice shot by Murphy, but it's just a little wide. Still gets the rebound. Battle in the corner here. McIntyre loses it, goes over to Central. Aiden Kelly hoping to do something here. Oh, nice little check, but leaves the puck. Oh, nice block there. Dakota Murphy, or Courier, excuse me. Finally gets out for Central. This Memorial Crusaders, they're surprising that they do not have a single win. They are, f oh, bad pass there. Checked out of the way. Central with some pressure here. See what happens. Oh, no, out of the zone. Oh, we're going to get an offsides call. Matt Blair tried to keep it in the zone, but just was not strong enough to keep that puck inside the blue line. So we're going to fa have a faceoff here, which Central West has not looked good in the faceoff circle. So we'll see what happens here. Podios Vogus loses it. Central takes, oh, nice job by Parker there. Just misses it, but he gets it back, gets it in the zone. Gets it stolen from him. Still in the zone there by Memorial. They're battling that blue line. Nice flick pass. Justin Russell over to Parker Burgess. Nice battle. Memorial keeping it. Justin Russell skating around. Oh, he loses his edge. Still manages to keep the puck in though. And there, finally, Central West gets it out. Little pass over to Colin. Colin trying to make some moves. Urban Tinger. It's a tough one to say right there. Urban Tinger. I think I got that right. Oh, Central West defenseman falls. Oh, nice Duke. Oh, and a nice glove save there. Wow, some great moves by Justin Russell there. But a clean save by Jordan Lamar. And we will get a face off in the Central West zone. I got to tell you that, that second line there for 
Memorial is looking very good, but they're not the starters. The starters are out there now. The official being nice and doing a little helmet check there. Memorial wins it again. Stolen. Oh, stolen back. This is, finally it's out of the zone. Cleared out by Aiden Kelly. Throws it down. Justin Austin, or James Austin. Slapper, just a little over, a little too high over the nets. Kenneth McIntyre throws it up there. Burrows fighting for it in the corner, loses it, goes to central, but Memorial keeps it in the zone, backhands it, hits the glass. Memorial is just skating a little bit faster than Central West, but Central West is still doing a pretty go okay job so far. McIntyre keeping it in. Oh, we got a cross. Oh, a little, tried to go for a nice smooth Macchio Vincent. Aiden Kelly coming up, throws it a little wide past the net. Oh, Coaches are not very happy with Finn McDonough there. He should have gone and gotten that puck. Memorial coming back. Oh, nice. Oh, keeps it. Oh, finally out of the zone. Matt LaForge fighting for that. Oh, he's a little offside. Oh, nice up high check there. Aiden Kelly finally can get in the zone. Line change for the Central West. Dimitri Alexander in, throws it a little far. Ryan Ladd gets it. Central West coaches yelling for the players just to skate a little bit harder. These pucks are right there for the for the taken, but there no one's there in time for it. Macchio Vincent tries to keep it in, but it's finally out, cleared out. Central West tries for this. Oh, it's going to be a uh, icing here. No call on that. Wow. Okay, I was surprised. I expected that to be an icing, but official said no. Central West, nice blue line shot by Matt Blair. Central West, oh, turnover. Oh, tough collision. Colin Urban Tanger. Tinger, excuse me. Oh, here we go. Can Memorial do anything here? Parker Burgess and Matthew Gazetta, we're right there. But Central clears it, brings it back to the other end. Pass to no one there, but it finally ends up on the blade of Ray Custodio. This Memorial's doing, just doing a great job of keeping this in the Central West zone. Justin Russell fighting for the corner. He gets it back. Oh, just a little bit out far of his reach. Good job by the Central West defenseman, but it's going to be an icing on that call. Line change for both teams there. I say Matt Blair is doing a good job of keeping that defensive line. We still have 8.30 to go in this first period. Got too many men on the ice right now, unless Memorial can get off. And it finally does. All right. Face off. One by Aiden Kelly, but is now stuck in the corner there. It's a fight for it. Finally gets out of the end. Brandon Burroughs tried to keep it in, but it just would not work. Central coming down the other end. Aiden Kelly throws it in. Matt LaForge. No one's there, though, and it's, oh, bad pass. Aiden Kelly with a wrister. Saved. Boy, that was a quick snap there by Aiden. But goalie Matthew Scott was very well prepared and in the right position for it. Memorial tries to clear the zone. It is not. Ooh. Aiden Kelly with another backhand shot. He's getting the nice job keeping it in the center of the ice. He's getting some great opportunities here. We'll see if he finally can get a goal. Oh, a lot of hitting over there in that end of the ice. Oh, the official hits off his skate. Central West steals it, throws it back. It's a battle in the neutral zone ice. 
A lot of guys falling down right there. Sam Lewis is trying to do something. Oh, here we go. Aiden Kelly is down there along with Finn McDonough. Finn gets it. Fight for the puck. Aiden Kelly comes and helps him, takes the puck. Tries to throw, but it's deflected. Nice job by Guzetta. Now finally, Memorial is trying to do something. Nice up high check by James Austin. Battle, the, oh, he's trying to make some plays off his knees. I am, wow, that was a great, oh, big check by Aiden Kelly. But that didn't really affect Guzetta. Finally, it gets out of the zone. Nice flick by Burroughs to get it out. Throw it in. Oh, boy, that stick, right off the stick, it went up in the air. Good thing it didn't ricochet into the net. That would have been a very embarrassing goal there by Matthew Scott. And we got an icing there. It's going to end up down in the Memorial Zone. So Central West putting a little pressure here in those last two minutes and 20 seconds here. They're trying to get this game tied up here. It's like Fodios Vogus with the face off. Goes back to Memorial. Chase Fidella with it. Throws it out. Trying to set something up here, it looks like. Oh, just out of the zone. Oh, it says it's tipped and it's not going to be an icing. There's a battle for it. Kenneth McIntyre wins it. Try to get it back to McIntyre, but it was unsuccessful. Battle in the corner again. Oof. Nice wrist shot from the corner by Fidella. Oh, nice save. Let's see what happens here. Can he do it? Oh, he stopped. But it's finally put in a juicy rebound goal by Brandon Burrows. Makes the Crusaders go up 2-0 here. Boy, I thought that Bo Parlant was going to possibly get the goal, but it hit off the goalie, laid it in the ice, and next thing you know, we got a goal by Brandon Burroughs. So it's 2-0 Memorial Crusaders. Wow. That was very juicy, everyone. That was a good, nice goal, and now Memorial wins the faceoff, trying to go for possibly more. Goes up, ooh, almost a little, little elbow to the head there to Parker Burgess. Oh, and we do have another goal. Guzetta goes top shelf just over the goalie's shoulder to make this a three nothing game. Burgess did a good job of hitting that. He, I, he should get the assist on that. It was a nice backhand pass, no look. Right, went right to Guzetta who just gets that goal. Three nothing Memorial here. Wow, it's just a, two quick goals, just a matter of 13 seconds. Aiden Kelly gets it, trying to do something. Oh, it's just out past the goalie. Rookie Boparlin gets, he gets the assist, not Burgess. Oh, big check, oh no. This does not look good for Parker Burgess. He is down in in some pain. They're calling for the trainer to get down there. He took a very hard collision into the boards there, just to the left of the Central West goalie. He was battling for it and just got a little clipped and he, down he went. So we can only hope that he is gonna be okay. He's a very good freshman here for the Memorial Crusaders and he's, he's aiming for his backside there. So this is not gonna be good. Both, uh, Teams are in their huddles. Memorial's a little bit down on their knees. Nice that respect from the teammates here at Memorial. We got uh, Brandon Burrows and Justin Russell on one knee. So the other player's down by the goalie here. You never want to see an injury here, and especially when uh, your team's up 3 nothing. He's Central West is trying to talk to a little pep talk. Oh, he's up on his knees. This is a good sign here. Burrows and 
Russell are there to help him out. He says he's okay. He's a, he's a tough kid. He's, he knows how to take some pain with first game of the year with a clothesline to, uh, to that hit there. He's, he says he's going to be good. He's going to take some time to, uh, to feel the pain. No penalty on that play either. So it was just a clean hit. And it, just with the speed that he has, Burgess is definitely one of the faster skaters on this Crusaders team. We're going to get a face-off here. Kenneth McIntyre and Aiden Kelly. The starters here are back out on the ice. Finn McDonough won again by Memorial. Throws it back just past this. Sam Lewis. Oh. Parker did get this assist on the third goal, so I was wrong there. I apologize. Guzetta has a second goal of the game. He's looking for a hat trick already in just this first period. A little shot in there. Aaron Fournier. And nice clearing pass. And it will be an icing, though. Finn McDonough was just trying to do anything he could to get it out of the zone and just a little bit too hard off the glass down to the other end of the ice. So we got a new line here for Memorial. Do a quick line change. We got Massio Vincent there with a the face off, along with Dimitri Alexander. Alexander doesn't even go for the puck, goes for the player, but finally gets the puck. Just slap it on the puck, and Alexander gets it, throws it. Nice save. Jordan Lamar was pushed it to the end. Now we got Memorial with a lot of pressure here. Finally, we got Central West getting it out and throwing it in. See if they can do anything here. Oh, back to the blue line, stop. Oh, and it is out now. Dakota Courier throws it back, but he cannot touch it. He has not gone past the blue line. He does a good job of trying to skate as fast as he could, but already Memorial coming back, going right through the whole entire team. Look at this by Brandon Murphy. Oh, off the goalie, or off the goalie, the referee. Memorial with the, oh, nice save. Boy, oh, that's embarrassing. Ryan Ladd was trying to deflect that in the goal, but it was stopped by the goalie. Central and West player comes over, tries to get him away from it, and uh, ends up taking a little fall. So, tough part about trying to be the enforcer. You're not always the best skater there. Gazetta with the face off, but it's lost over to Central West. It is hit out. Hard skating here from Memorial. Guzetta throws it out. Down the other end, just missed by the Courier. Oh, nice centering pass. Oh, it finally gets over, and we do have a goal. Look at that. Guzetta with another goal here for this Memorial Crusader team, and it is now 4-0 with just three minutes and seven seconds remaining in this first period here. Memorial has found their touch. They, you know, they might have a record of 0-10-1, but they got some goal scorers here. Cosetta gonna take the face off again. He's just full of energy right now after that goal. Skating up, Burgess back on the ice. Falls to his knees, centers it. Goes to the other corner. Oh, and we have another goal. Parker Burgess got the assist on that one, but this time Justin Russell gets the goal. Wow, I did not expect this game. I, I thought it was gonna be a little bit tighter here between Central West and Memorial. Instead, we are getting a bloodbath here in the first period. This Memorial Crusader team is red and they are feeling the blood of Central West falling out. Central West trying to do anything that they can to get back into this game. And the skates, Burroughs finally gets it out of his leg. Oh, nice move. And we got a shot in. And we will get a penalty here. Colin Ermentanger with a nice shot from the blue line. And we're gonna get a trip call on Memorial. This could be huge for Central West. They need any 
thing to help get them their energy and interest in this game. Coach Fisher wants to come have talk to Dakota Courier. The goal, the, excuse me, the penalty will go to the Ray Castudio. You get two minutes for tripping. One by Central West, thrown a little too far wide by Courier. Blue line. Oh, we got a snapshot. Just blocked. Good job by number 11 of James Austin with the stop there. But Aiden Kelly still got it. Throw it a little bit behind the goal. Oh, and then finally Memorial clears it out. Bo Parlin with the, some pressure here. Central West trying to get anything that they can to get it out of the zone. Dakota Courier goes up. Aiden Kelly with it. He's got Finn McDonough. Finn McDonough throws it back. And it is cleared again by the Memorial Crusaders. Skating down is Photius Vogus. Skating around with the captain. Photius with it, throws it up. Still with the uh, attempt to in the corner. Blocked off by Murphy. Oh boy, that was a good snapper there by Courier. Just missed the goal, but it had a lot of people looking. Aiden Kelly with it. Throws it back to Matt LaForge. LaForge missed by Crusaders. Oh, to Photius. Photius with the goal! Beautiful shot. Excuse me, that's Dakota Courier. Central West gets on this board, this power play goal. Making it five to one. They are very excited here. Some high fives. Dakota Courier with a power play goal. Make this a 5-1 game. We're hoping that something would happen for Central West. And finally, we get it with a minute four remaining in this first period. Parker Burgess, three on one. He's, he's hit again, down his, throws it around. Nice job by Air, Ethan Fournier. Oh, Parker comes back with a check. Goes behind the net, around the boards. Again by Fournier, keeping it in. Fournier is controlling that blue line over there. Now it's a battle. Memorial Central West with three players to two by Memorial. It finally goes to the other end of the ice. Murphy gets it. Nice little stop. They're fighting for this in the last 20 seconds in this period. Oh, now we got something here. Can Russell get it? Oh, it is called an icing. Fournier was, excuse me, Russell was trying to stop that from happening and he unfortunately did not make it in time. And now with 14 seconds to go, see if Central can do something else here. Aiden Kelly will take the face off. It is one, but it's just a little too wide. It's come down to the other end. Parker Burgess with it, steals it. Comes around, centers it. Oh, just a little off the skates. Oh, it's, unfortunately nothing's gonna happen here and we're gonna go to the first intermission. It was a great job by Parker to get to that pocket and he tried to center it over. It just hit off the, uh, the skates and was not able to go in. So we'll go to this first intermission here with a 5-1 Memorial Crusader lead here on Manchester Public Television's Hockey Central. And with the power of TV, we are back for the second period action here at the John Fitzgerald Kennedy Coliseum here in Manchester between the Memorial Crusaders and the Central West Little Knights is what I'm gonna be calling them for the rest of this game. It is a 5-1 advantage for the Memorial Crusaders right now. Central West was looking so pretty good at the end of the first period here, getting their goal, lone goal. So we'll see what can happen here. Face off, one by Memorial here. We had some uh, goalie change here for the Central West. Now in goal, we have Donnie Collins here. He had one save at the end of the first period. 
He now comes in in goal for the Central West. But here we are at Central West trying to get some something going here in the Memorial Crusader end, but is finally taken away. Nice quick pass, but this will probably be an icing here. Pass was trying to get up to Ricky Boparlin, but just a little bit far, and it'll come back to the Central West end. Officials here are having a good time. They, uh, they're they razzing the Central West side right before the, we got back to this broadcast. As uh, he was saying, I'm 47 years old, and I still skate better than you guys. So we got some fun officials here. Face off one by Central West, but Memorial gets to it. Now here we go, let's, oh, nice, almost snapshot there by Matt LaForge, but it just is deflected wide. They're trying to, oh, nice, keeping it in, but it finally squirts out. Matt Blair was protecting that blue line. Central Memorial coming down. Hit off the puck. Guzetta, who already has three goals, he already has a hat trick in the first period. But Central West, here we go. Kenny gets the puck. Oh, he, he's going to be offsides. And that's what the official rules. Yep. Oh, now we got some extracurricular activities going on. We got Custodio, who's already had two minutes in the box. He's giving a little uh, shimmy to Central West, but he says he apologizes. And coach is looking at him as he gets onto the, the bench. Now we got face off here. One by Central West. Fodius with the goal, or excuse me, I thought he had the goal, but he never did. That one took a Dakota Courier in the first for Central West. Gives up the puck, goes right over. Back to defenseman. Good job by Fournier. He looked very good in this first period. Tries to get it out, and it's a far pass, but just a little bit too far, and it will go for an icing. Parker Jones really wanted that. He was skating hard, but it's gonna be an icing, goes to the other end of the ice. Line change for both sides. I'm gonna get the fresh legs, you know, with just a minute and 34 seconds into this. But we got too many men for Central West. He finally just realizes it and doesn't get off the ice in time, but no call on that. Interesting. One by Central West. Finn McDonough trying to do anything he can. Over to Aiden Kelly. Back over. Oh, a big collision, almost a little head hunt in there. I hope that Noah Orr is okay there. He seems to be okay, but that was definitely a, a shoulder to the head. And we have a long pass that it will go for an icing. I thought that Sam Lewis had a, a little bit of a chance to get that, but went right past him and good move on his part to get an icing, get the uh, face off in the Memorial Crusaders end. We got Aiden Kelly with the face off. It is one though by Memorial. Gazetta. Gazetta fighting for it again. He's makes a move, going around. He's still got the puck, skating around. Oh, and it goes up. Parker Burgess on his knees, but is hit away. Good job by Central West to get that puck away. And here we go. Do they have something? It is stopped. And we're gonna get a penalty there. Aiden Kelly with a great move. Puck might not have gone in, but he at least gets the penalty call. We got an interference there. And Guzetta with the hat trick will spend two minutes alone by himself in the penalty box. This could be key for Central West. They need to get something going here with a down four goals right now. Face off, hit over. Nice wide shot, but just Aiden Kelly was not, had it deflected. Back to Kelly, makes some moves, trying to get it over, but it's, to, Memorial did a good job of not letting it go much further. Oh boy, look at this though. We have a breakaway and it is stopped. Good job there. Kenneth McIntyre had the advantage, but it was stopped by Donnie Collins. Oh, again though, McIntyre, oh, oh my, between the leg shot, just wide. Boy, you almost think that Memorial had the power play right now because two great tries 
by Kenneth McIntyre. Now deflected down the other way, but it's stopped. Dakota Courier looks. Now, oh, loses the puck. Matt, Bl Brandon Burrows comes in, but it is checked out of here. He's still sliding. Central West with a try, with a shot, but he, he's kind of overpowered and didn't get a very much good wood on that. Central West trying to pass out to the blue line and is just a little too far for Fotius. Fotius throws it back in. Everyone's cleared. He's still got 35 seconds left on this power play. Let's see if Central West can get this puck back. Nice pass in there by Central West. Oh, he's going to be called for the offsides. Burroughs wanted to do something there. He had a, a plan. Oh, big open ice check there. Stop him the Crusaders, but refs say to let go of the puck. Throws it down. This will not be an icing because there's still 10 seconds remaining on this power play. Colin sits it aside to Colin or to Aiden. Aiden throws it out. We're still got an offside. So Central West power play is over, but they have some men coming down with some move. A check, no call on that. It was clean one. Aiden Kelly looks exhausted. He's been out on this ice for a while. Memorial coming down the other way. Oh, nice try. Oh, good save by Collins. Nice arm hit. Parker Burgess. Oh, nice move. Oh, and we have a goal. That was sick, ladies and gentlemen. That was a beautiful goal. I will give it that. Memorial will take a 6-1 to one lead there. He's even saying, yep, I had that all planned. So good job by Guzetta for his fourth goal of the game. Guzetta's just running this game like no one else today. And he'll take the face off, because why not? That's what four goal scorers do. And he wins it too. Back to Fournier. Fournier looking up ice, trying to decide. Central West, oh, almost stolen there. Good job by Parker Jones. Parker Burgess does get another assist. That This line, like I said in the beginning, the second line to four Memorial Crusaders is very good. Oh, we're gonna get a penalty call against Central West. No, never mind. that was just not delayed offsides. Hit over in the corner, battle for it. Justin Russell, back to the point. Just a little up. Nice job by Custodio to throw that at the, the net, but it just went a little too high and into the net above the glass. And we're gonna get a face off. Ref officials are talking about where this face off will come and it looks like it's gonna go just to the left of the Central West goalie, Donnie Collins. Nacio Vincent wins the face off. Goes to the defenseman. Murphy throws it past. Central West trying. Oh, finally, I think that came out. Yes. Oh, uh, yeah, we finally got an offsides call there. No line changes here. We're going to get the same exact player. So Massio Vincent with the face off again for Central West. But nice job by number four, Aiden Kelly, to try to win that. Central West gets it, but behind their own zone, Memorial keeps it in. A centering pass, a little bit too much mustard on that. A little too far. James Austin with it. Throws it up. Oh, now it's stolen. Good job by Matt LaForge. We got something going on for Central West. Can he take the shot? Oh, he does, and it's just a little too wide. Noah Orr with some wood on that. He still keeps it in, kicks it up. Aiden Kelly with the little check there and it's finally cleared out. Collins has to come out of the net. We got a check there. Finally getting up, everyone's got it. it oh, we had a goal! James Austin just throws it at the net. That's sometimes all you need to do to get a goal and he gets it to give this game a seven to one Memorial Crusader lead over the Central West Little Knights. I don't know if I should call them the blue green at this point. I don't know if that'll make it any better, but Memorial Crusaders are controlling this game. And at this rate, with just 8.30 remaining in the period, they have a six goal lead and looking very good to get this win. 
And it's won by the Crusaders. They keep it in the zone. Fight for it. Make some moves. Masio Vincent with the assist on that play. Comes back. We got Memorial. Possibly three on two. Nice move. Now we got a two on one. And now we got Burroughs all by himself. Passes it back over. Oh, and he misses the net. That would have been beautiful by Ricky Parlant. Memorial. They, they gave, you know, a little too much. Oh, a little too high there. Parlant with a great couple nice shots, but they're a little too high for this goalie. I thought Donnie Collins was the spark that the Central West team needed. He, he had some good saves to start off, but it, it is not going the way, very good here for Central West. Oh, their Crusaders are still fighting. They're not giving Central West any time to even try to come back in this game. They're skating hard. Kenneth McIntyre here. Fighting for it. Oh, look at this. Another, oh, McIntyre, not McIntyre, excuse me, Burroughs. Skating around, trying to find the open guy. Look at that, and it's saved. Brandon Burroughs with, oh, on the doorstep. Oh, they're giving him the goal? Is this right? Am I seeing this right? They they are finally scored a snowman. It is now eight to one Memorial Crusaders. I did not see Burroughs get that goal. I did, thought it was saved by the goalie, but I was wrong, I'll admit. And instead, Burroughs with a goal. Memorial Crusaders keeping this gas going. And now we got Burgess skating around. They figured out a way to get around Collins. Oh, on the doorstep. Justin Russell with an assist on that last goal by Burroughs. But here we go. Central coming down, nice move, and tries with a shot and is missed. Oh, a great chance by Finn McDonough. I was hoping for something for Central West. It's never fun when it's uh, you're down seven goals here, but they're still playing hard. They, they're trying to get some more goals. Good job by Finn there. 50-50 raffle, we got a nice, uh, Stingent of fans here. There's six different spots with a good amount of fans here in the JFK Coliseum here. Uh, hopefully he doesn't play. There we go. Now he pushes it to the side. I was going to say the goalie should not be uh, holding that puck. There's no one in the way. But here we go. Central West tries for the clearing pass or centering pass. Did not work. Oh, off the goalie. Right on the doorstep. Oh, nice stop. Uh, two great saves there. Matt LaForge with a couple of good tries. But Matthew Scott is up for the challenge. Now Central, trying to get out of the way. Pass up, throws it into the zone, but it is right there over to Fournier. Fournier passes it around. Now we might be going the other way here. Oh, Central West keeps it in. Aiden Kelly on the blue line. Shakes, spakes, shoots, and it's deflected. Somehow, I think he got his own rebound on that. Yeah, no one was, no one was trying for it. Oh, kept in. Oh, but it's finally hit out, thrown back in. And it's just a battle of neutral ice here. Oh, look at this, LaForge. Make some moves. Where's this been for Central West? LaForge is just keeping this puck inside the zone, but it's finally thrown the other way. And uh-oh, this can not, oh, it's finally we got an icing. I'm like, Bopar looks like he's got no one around him if he just could skate a little bit faster, but with uh, 10 minutes gone in this second intermission, it is eight to one. Manchester Community Television's Hockey Central here between the Memorial Crusaders and the Central West Blue Knights. Not the game anyone was expecting so far. A just demolishing so far by my Memorial Crusaders, but the Central West team is playing very hard and they are not going out without a fight. There's some confusion here. Oh, we got a penalty. And yes, the officials realized that the 
faceoff should be on the other end of the ice. I did not see the roughing call to Noah Orr, but that's a, what the official said. And now we have a faceoff in the Central West zone. It is won by Memorial. Back to the defenseman. Get, throws it around. Bo Parlin with it. Throws it over. Snap it. Oh, it's on the doorstep. And it is through. A power play goal by none other than Brandon Burroughs, his second that I'm aware of. So if we have two players with hat tricks in this game, this could be pretty rough here. I, I, there's not too many people wearing hats in this crowd anymore because they've all been thrown on the ice from the first hat trick. So we'll see what happens here. The power, that was just a quick power play there by the Crusaders. And it is now nine to one. Oh, we will have another call. This one is gonna go on Memorial. Oh, we are getting a lot of aggression here from the Central West in the officials here. Kenneth McIntyre is gonna spend two minutes in the box here. Refs are talking this over. And we are gonna get a penalty on the Central West for unsportsmanlike bench minor. Someone was uh, yelling at the officials and uh, officials do not tolerate that. Let's see who uh, see who ends up in the box here. This is a uh, never want to see this. I mean, I understand it's it's tough when you're down nine to one and you haven't won a game this year, but you always want to treat the officials with the dignity and respect. They're out here uh, doing their job, and you know you, we should just all appreciate them for what they are. As in the box goes none other than the captain, Photius Vogus. So we got to, officials are talking to both coaches here. Both Eric Fisher, he's been down there talking to the officials right by the penalty box. And Mark Putney clarifying things. I think we're gonna get some four on four hockey possibly. We'll see what happens here. The face off will come down in the Memorial Crusader end. Oh, we're going to get another penalty on Memorial Crusaders. And into the box goes Brandon Murphy. So, we are actually going to get a power play for Central West. This is going to be interesting here. Central West down eight goals. See if they can do something here. But Memorial says, nope, we will take care of things. As James Austin looks around, passes it up to Burroughs. Burroughs goes around, just throws it into the corner. We get an elbowing call, an unsportsmanlike conduct call. Just hearing the... Uh, what the calls were and the officials were. But that's interesting. I, unsportsmanlike conducts, Brandon Murphy, Kenneth McIntyre there sitting in the box, defenseman and a forward. But Crusaders are just doing all that they can. Just keep this puck away from their goalie. He has only let one goal in so far and Matthew Scott is doing a good job. He had seven saves in the first period. I don't know how many he has so far in the second. He decides to cover up. Nice shot from the edge. We got some line changes here for both sides. Coach Boyle is saying, come here, buddy. And we got a quick change over. There wasn't enough players on the ice, so onto the ice comes Ryan Ladd. Bo Parlin with the face off. It's won by Central West, shot from the end, and it's just wide. 
It looks good for Aiden Kelly. Skate around, looking, just go get it. Oh, we got a goal! Aiden Kelly with a sweet pass to LaForge who finally gets a goal. A power play goal there for the Central West, making this a 9-2 to game. That was a sweet pass by Aiden over to LaForge who just throws it into the back of the net. And Matthew Scott can only just lean against the goalpost saying, oh man, I should have had that. So 40 seconds still remaining for the two gentlemen in the box. For the, we've got Photius and McIntyre who are just chilling in the box for another 40 seconds. Oh, face off one by Kelly. He throws it in the zone. He's trying, oh, it's finally hit away, but it's still in the zone. Oh, good job by the defenseman there. Noah Orr just came out of the box, was just doing anything he could. And now look, we got something going on from Central West. They're trying to get anything they can back into this game. The Forge fighting for it, fighting for it. Checking, hitting, oh, we got some coming around. Open shot, and it is stopped. It's up in the air. No one knew where it was. Good job by Scott. Just absolutely saying no to Finn McDonough. Finn had nothing but open ice. That's something you practice in your backyard and he just could not get it past the goalie. But look at this, nice moves by Aiden Kelly. He's going around all the defense and oh, and it's barely out of the zone. That was a nice centering pass, but Noah Orr could not stop the puck from getting out. Central trying to get out of their zone. Memorial keeps throwing it out. Oh, unexpected pass. Oh, I don't know what that call is all about there. I, I didn't see the puck come out, but apparently the officials have a different eyes than I do. And they have a whistle and I do not. So I understand that they, uh, they get to make that call and I don't. I will just stay up here in the booth and talk to everyone about this 9-2 Memorial Crusader lead here with two minutes and 13 seconds remaining in this second period. Face off won by Memorial. Skates around, backhand, throws it into the zone. James Austin, back to Austin. He's skating backwards, looking, throws it over. Now we got Burgess coming around. He's passes it over. He's got, I didn't think he was gonna keep the puck there. I thought that Central was gonna get it, but no, look at this. Pass over. Oh, they're just skating all around. Oh, a centering pass, but Burgess was not expecting that. James Austin with the puck, throws it over. Pass, Memorial trying to set something up there. Murphy, Murphy skating, skating with the puck still. Looking, marking, keeping it. Back to Burgess, Burgess skating. With, got some, oh, back, nice backhand pass. Over to Russell, Russell to Burgess. Skating around, looking, looking, oh, excuse me, now it's to Burgess. That was Guzetta. Guzetta keeps it. Oh, look at this. Can he do something? Burgess with it, but can't, he's locked up. We just have one minute remaining in this period. Central West finally clears the puck, but it should be an icing. And it is, it's gonna come back around. Boy, this energy line for Memorial is looking very good there. Nice passing by Russell Burgess. I thought that they were eventually gonna get a puck there, or a puck into the net to make it a 10 to two lead, but I'm wrong and with 57 seconds, we got the uh, the starting line, excuse me, the third line, Massio Vincent and Ryan Ladd. We got a, a face off one. Central West gets it though, comes around, trying to clear it. Finally he does. Still, oh, nice moves. Oh, and it's gonna be called an offsides. Oh, Noah Orr finally got that puck and was making some moves, but one of his teammates was just a little too far on the line there. Kyle Bouchard might have been the, uh, the culprit there. But we'll just leave that to the unknown. Face off after this offsides. The officials are looking at each other like it's a staring contest, trying to decide what to do. And he's thrown out. Matt Lassar didn't see him do anything wrong, but Noah Orr takes the face off, loses it over to Central West. Oh, pass, oh, actually, 
Central West keeps it in. It's Memorial trying to get some moves with just the final 30 seconds into the, in this period here. Dimitri Alexander. Oh, we got a goal. No, officials say no. It was off the crossbar. The goalie was not making any moves. Everyone, oh, we got a lot of boo in here. But see what uh, Memorial now is called for the offsides. Whew, a lot of upset people over here right now, including this red bench over here. It looked like Dimitri Alexander had a goal. It, he could definitely hear it off the crossbar, but apparently did not want to go in with 17 seconds ago. Nice check by Memorial. Brings it back, 10 seconds remaining. Cross ice pass, hits it out. Oh, and it's now gonna go to the intermission break here with a seven goal lead for these Crusaders. That's gonna do it for myself, Kyle Heavey with Manchester Public Television. We'll still be having this game for the third period, but unfortunately I cannot stay any longer. So thank you very much for the commentary listening here. We'll be back with the third period action after this break. Manchester Public Television's Hockey Central.
Number eight, Mark Gazzola. Purchase from Russell Gazzola at 215.
going on the play on the power play.
difference. And so if you try hard, you don't need to get something. You don't need to say, hey, we're going to get hurt. Let's just try. You might not be better. One minute remaining in the period. 